YouTube has a new button that you need to be aware of because you need to toggle on yes or no, but it's a little bit hidden when you upload videos. This new button is all about altered content. So if you're changing reality in some way, you need to denote that in your videos because we're seeing more and more AI generated content out in the world and they just want to put the appropriate labels on and make sure it's reaching the correct people. So this altered content button is actually hidden. You have to click to expand it. And this is where you're going to click to see, you know, your chapters where you're going to be able to put those, all of those extra things. As you're uploading your video, you have to expand it. And if you are already uploading that video and you're just going in to edit it before you post it, it is going to be present on that page when you scroll down. Now, specifically, altered content is denoted as any footage that makes a real person appear to say or do something that they didn't say or do. It alters footage of a real event or place, or it generates a realistic looking scene that didn't actually occur. And then you just have to toggle that button yes or no. Now, this is not going to hurt your reach at this point. This is just so that you start building up your credibility as you are noting what you've done inside of your video. And even if you are not using AI generation or altering things inside of your videos to look realistic when it's not, you want to make sure you're going in on all of your future videos. You don't necessarily have to go and do it to all the past videos but do it on your upcoming videos saying yes or no. If you have a good track record of saying yes or no, they're going to be more trusting of you in the future. This is very similar to how we are letting people know whether there's anything problematic in our content when it comes to that monetization. So you know how if you are a monetized channel, you have to say if there's anything that goes against some of their terms of service or something that's just going to put labels and some blocks on your content. The more you do this in an accurate capacity, the more they are willing to say, we trust you. If you say there's nothing there, or if you say there's something there, we trust you. This is what we want to build up our credibility with, with YouTube. So while it's not impacting us at all right now, building up that track record of being truthful on this is going to help us rank better in the algorithm system and allow the algorithm to trust us a little bit more when it comes to them putting more rules and regulations on AI generated content on the platform. So make sure that you are always expanding that link. You can go in and you can put your chapters, you can put all of your other things that are in that expanded collapsible section. And again, if you have uploaded the video, but not put it out to the public, you just lifted it, listed it as unlisted. You can go in and just scroll down. You'll be able to see all those things and you can toggle on and off those buttons. But this is a brand new feature. It just showed up a few days ago and we want to make sure we are leveraging this now to our benefit later. Drop your questions on this down below and we'll see you in the upcoming videos as we continue to help you navigate the world of YouTube and Instagram and TikTok and live streaming and all the tools and resources you need to level up as a content creator to save time and effort and energy so this can be your most profitable year ever. We'll see in the upcoming episodes.